In this video, we're going to be talking about French question words. Now, there's many of them, and it's very important to know this, and so that's why we're, uh, we're going over them. So, our first question word is key. Key means who or whom. There aren't two words like in English, so it's a little bit easier in French to figure this out because you don't have to figure out which one you're using, who or whom, you just use key. The next one is quoi. Qua means what. Now, what, you're not going to use what. You're not going to use qua when you don't hear somebody, when you don't uh, understand what they say, when you need them to repeat. Okay? In English, that's impolite. It's impolite in French as well. So you want to use a different word, and we'll get that to that one in a minute. Our next one is où. Où means where. Now, it is very important that when you're meaning where, that you have this accent grave over the U. If there is no accent grave over the U, then it just means or. But like this, with the accent grave over the U, it means where. Quand means when. Okay? Quand. It means when, obviously, you use it in the same place. The next one is pourquoi. Pourquoi means why. It's a combination of for and how, or for and what, and it means why. Our next one here is como. Como means how. Now, como is our word that we use in place of qua. If you don't hear somebody, if you don't understand what they say, you need them to repeat. You, the polite way to ask is you ask como, and then they repeat what they are asking. It's just as implied in French as it is in English to have somebody say, what? Our next question word is combien. Combien means how much or how many. It, it is used in both uh, ways. They don't have a separate word in French for this. It's combined. Combien. Our next word here is qu'est-ce que. Qu'est-ce que literally means what is it that. Qu'est-ce que will usually be placed at the beginning of a statement in order to make it a question. Uh, we'll have videos later in the year in French 1, uh, but there will be other videos that will talk about how to make a question in French. But this is... This word will be used in it, okay, as it is a way to make a statement into a question in French. Our last question word in French is quel. Now, quel needs to change depending on what it is you are asking about. Quel means which. So, if you're asking about an art, something that is masculine and singular, then you would use this form of quel, Q-U-E-L. Now, if it is masculine and it is plural, you'll use this form, Q-U-E-L-S, if it's masculine and plural. Now, if it is feminine and singular, you'll use this form of quel right here, Q-U-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. That's feminine and singular. And if it is feminine and plural that you're asking about, it is quel in this form right here, Q-U-E-L-L-E-S. All forms are pronounced cal. So there's not one uh, a way to make it different. It doesn't sound different if you're using a different form of cal. They are all pronounced cal. Now these so these are our these are our French question words. Alright, you can watch this video again if you need to remember or go over what each of them mean again. Uh, you can also ask me questions before, after, or during class in order to make sure that you understand exactly what's going on with each of, with each of these. You can also um, the comments on the video or you can email me personally. So I will see you in class.